Welcome to the video tutorial on ICM geometry cleanup of a control wall. This is part 4 of the video tutorial. We have cleaned up most of the fluid domain that we want. Now we will deal with the central portion that is the central cylindrical geometry. There are a lot of unwanted surfaces and the exact topology is very complex. What we need is simple surfaces which act as wall for our fluid domain. So we will clean this central portion, create and modify the surfaces as we require. We will also require some additional curves which we will build by using build topology operation. Now we have blanked the fluid domain outer surface so that we can visualize the central portion properly. These are the outer surfaces which are not in contact with the fluid domain so we delete them. We will create some additional surfaces to simplify the complex geometry. So this is the exact geometry that we need to simplify. We select the outer surfaces and we delete the outer geometry or surfaces. So this is this central cylindrical portion is all we need that because it is in contact with fluid. But there are also some additional curved surfaces or additional complex surfaces we need which we need to simplify. So what we do is uh, we use build topology and create some additional curves. We will use create modify curve and we will create a curve by using surface and curve option. Then we are using create modify surface and we will create a surface from that generated curve. As you can see a new surface has been created. Then we delete the exterior surface. So you see this is also an additional protruding surface that is there. So by using curve and surface modification operation we have deleted that smaller curve or smaller surface that was present. Next we use build topology to create some additional curves. Tolerance is given as 0.4, feature angle as 20. 
and the method we are using is all parts. We can play with the tolerance to delete the unwanted, unwanted curves that were created earlier. So if we use the build topology again with tolerance 1, as you see, the unwanted curves that were created have been deleted. We can play with this tolerance to adjust what curves we want to retain and what we want to delete. Again, we blank this outer surface in order to see the inner, inner geometry. As you can see, with a tolerance of 0.1, that additional curve was not retained. As you see one by one, these are the parts that we have cleaned up so far. So this is the central section that we operated on right now and we have modified quite a lot of surface by using the top build topology and surface modification operations. So we have mostly cleaned up most of our central geometry. We have extracted the fluid domain as well. So this is how our entire geometry looks like at the moment. Now all the curves that we have created, we need to move into a entity called curves. Because what we want in the solver are only surfaces. So we select all visible curves and put them into a part named curve. We may need to use them later. Thank you for viewing this part of the video tutorial. See you in the next part.